There's a lot of stuff that's coming at us, at the camera, anyway. Outer space looks like a busy place. It's getting busier. Every day. All right. Bing, bang, boom. Did you see that? So this is why we've been crazy. Is because the sun is crazy. Everybody love photograph anomalies. Oh, no. Here we go. That's crazy. That is a lot of interstellar medium. All right. I apologize. I'm going to be acting weird. So that's what I'm going to do during this video. I'm going to act weird and then talk about solar physics and the sun and what the sun is doing because spaceweather.com said that solar activity was low. So it's like that's a, our key code phrase that nobody else knows. You know, it's like when they go, solar activity is low. That means like, hey, Thor, it's a bad signal. Go check out the sun. I'm like, oh, yeah, there's giant firing loops looking like a giant hero firing out the sun right now. Oh, plus some giant flaming V-birds. V-birds, whoa. That was a solar system right there. <laughs> and just like you, the sun is beautiful. Ladies and gentlemen, I present you with some solar system celestial phenomena. Like, what the hell are those boxes and triangles? Is like Jupiter moving somewhere? I'll run this town. All right. Put your Tommy guns away. I will make her smile before the night is over. Asterisk? That was a smirk. That shit don't count. Wow, so there's just totally crazy shit on all these cameras. Are you cool? Because I'm going to be dropping some hard Thor new science upon you. Stay cool. Hit the button, baby. Well, this is space. There's space all over the place. Hell yeah! We're flying now! This is a Thor News presentation. Party dance time. Thor News presents... I'm seeing a whole lot of anomaly. Are you seeing it with me? So this is why we've been crazy. Is because the sun is crazy. Maybe. Sure, baby. Okay, here we have Whoa. a chunk of the sun. Going boom, boom. Fantastic. You know, that's always fun for me. That was like four smoke rings. Whoa. Yeah, it's crazy, huh? Solar smoke rings of plasma headed your way if you're in that direction. So I thought I would totally do this video because I went over to the spaceweather.com. They are on the internet and they said, hey, solar activity is low. So that is always an excellent cue for me to go check out NASA's solar satellites, which give us such awesome solar photographs, except for one or two. Those ones are questionable. And here we go. We are watching solar inactivity right before our eyes. Yeah, and there's nothing going on in the interstellar medium there flying by. If you don't count the solar birds... Strange UFOs, smoke rings, cosmic diamond rings, interstellar mediums, multiple. There is so much stuff flying around the sun right now. It's not even funny. Look at how much stuff is flying by. It's crazy. It's coming in all different directions. But is space dust the same a gazillion miles away? Well, I think that's just a picture of what's coming at us. Or it's what's behind us because we're running away. Yeah. Oh. Totally low, bro. It's like the limbo of solar activity. That's cool, though. I just like watching the sun. It does cool stuff. And I've seen some pink and red skies lately. How's about you? Yeah, I got some pictures of some pink and red skies. Wow, look at all that. It's amazing. If I'm acting weird, it's because I'm in a weird mood. I'm feeling weird. I hope that's okay to endure... During my solar physics observations. Everybody love photograph anomalies. You think those are just long pieces of dust? Those straight lines? Yeah, so the sun gives birth to solar birds. And I said, fly on my sweet angel. Freeze frame. That planetoid was a centerfold. Reminds me of volcano, kinda. The sun's just like a volcano ball of light. Really? Hey, binary stars, hey, binary stars, hey, or asteroids, or rocks, or spaceships, whoa. What if the sun is just like a big ball of interstellar medium? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like a bunch of it got together. What if the sun was so much more than that? What if it was the thing that inspired at least 50% of all myths, mythologies, and religions. Whoa. Yeah. I like that. I've never seen that picture before. Well, you better thank your dragon, Kitty Pride. 
Ooh, those are pretty colors. It's like female lava. That is gorgeous. I think, therefore, I am. The sun is doing that thingy again. If you think about it, everything is pretty well put together. Hey, can I get somebody to explain this to me? Well, you see the sun is a ball of hydrogen fusing another element. And then light is created. It's a few. Yeah, but the interstellar medium's made up of hydrogen and helium, and that's what like stars are. They're just a big bunch of interstellar medium that are that wants to hang out together and glow. So you're saying it's like a just a giant pile of bones, dust, rock, gold, diamonds, ivory, jade, water, and cloud stuff, plus love, comic books, coffee, chocolate, kisses. Hugs and cuddles. Whoa. Double well, yo. Now here we are back again at the corona, the surface or skin of the sun. Technically, you could say the entire OR cloud is the surface of the sun. Light is in all things, except that which light is not in. Hell yeah, I said some stupid shit that sounded okay, so can I have his Nobel Prize now? Oh yeah, and we should unsimplify. The solar maximum metric maker. They just go off how many sunspots are there. That's it. They're like giant avatar trees dancing. Yeah, totally. Whoa. Solar trees. Solar leaves. Solar fruits. Wow. See, they're all loops. But they're more like jump rope loops. But they're not like perfect figure eight shapes. Or the ass end of a figure eight. Or the unass end of the figure eight, you know, whichever side you'd like to choose. Rockstarian Solar Physics brought to you by Thorin Sage. That was incredible. Is this too much data for you? And now we take a look at sunspots, which are spots on the sun, that are cooler than the other areas of the sun. Whoa. And sun quakes. That's when the sun shakes and they try to blame it on the camera. And solar tsunami bakes where a giant hydro flare rips from the sun, causing a sun tsunami. Surfers ride in and bake fantastic goods. There's great live music, and everybody has a good night. That's a true story. Asterisk is not true, dude. I just exaggerated. Probably another gamma ray burst. It sounds like, move, get out the way, get out the way, gamma burst. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. Does that count as activity, baby? Yeah, that counts as activity. Activity can have fishy definitions sometimes.